What's going on, everyone? Welcome to the Progressive Action TV show. I am your host, Tramel Thompson. And today we're going to discuss, was the Draymond Green punch on Jordan Poole a sneak attack? I've seen plenty of comments online about it being a sneak attack, it not being a sneak attack. We're going to discuss it, and we're also going to pull up other fights, skirmishes that involve Draymond Green in which he didn't treat them like he treated his teammate Jordan Poole. So just in case, if you did not see the actual incident, you see it right here. And let, and let me let me let me pause it right there, right? Um, we don't know what was said prior to Draymond Green punching him. In fact, let's go to the full video so we could get a full some some full insight as to what happened. You see Draymond Green, he's to the right of the screen. Him and Jordan Poole, see Jordan Poole with his hands on his hips, they are saying some words. They are having some words. We don't know what those words are. Now, at that point, I freeze it right there. At that point, we see Jordan Poole push Draymond Green. Now, where I'm from, if you don't, if you put hands on somebody, you got to expect hands to be put back on you, right? You must expect that, right? But I get what Jordan Poole probably was thinking. Let's continue on with the video. We see Draymond Green waste no time, hit him with a flush right to the face. You see Jordan Poole neck snap back. You see him drop. You see it's like Draymond Green tried to catch him or whatever the case is, but we see what happened there right now. Was it a sneak attack? I don't think it was a sneak attack. You put your hands on Jordan Poole, or on Draymond Green, and Draymond Green reacted. Now, that type of reaction shows that Draymond Green don't mess with homie. That's his teammate, but Draymond Green don't got no love for him. You do not do that to someone, your teammate, that you got love for. You don't do that to anyone that you got love for over a push. Now, on another, on the other end, we don't know what Jordan Poole said to him to warrant that type of response. But if I had to go out on a limb, I think that Draymond Green don't rock with him. Don't mess with him. Don't got no love for him. You do not do that to someone you got love for. Now, let's go through at least four other skirmishes that Draymond Green was involved in. We got him and Rondo. Everybody know that Rondo don't play. Everybody know that Rondo don't play. Rondo in his face. Rondo in his face. He's not doing anything. Let's look at let's look at one with him and LeBron. Let's look at one with him and LeBron. He takes a little swing that misses that. He don't want no smoke with LeBron. James stepping over him. The conversation look at that. continues. No the punch is going. And there's the double foul call by Gary No punch is going. Double foul does not result in any free throws. Obviously, each player let's go picks to up another one. personal. For Green, it's his third. Let's go to another one. Certainly unintentional. See, and now Green on it. and Gordon. Gordon. Exchanging words. Michael Malone. Green and Gordon. Spoke to his team yesterday. No, no smoke. Absolutely no smoke. But why did Green do this to Jordan Poole? I mean, what actually could have warranted that? You know, and 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 Jordan Poole got to understand, you know, he's young. He's 23 years old. I don't know what hood he's from. I don't know if he ever had a fight a day in his life. I know that he didn't expect Draymond Green to react the way he reacted, you know, but you cannot put hands on someone in any form or fashion and expect someone not to put hands on you. There's no, we not in the school, y'all. I push you, you push me. Nah, once you push me, it's on and popping. Right now, we also hear about, you know, who leaked the video, who, who you know, the person who leaked the video should be fired. I don't know um, how, I, how I feel about that. Um, 
I think that the video, the, 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 the video is going to cause more damage to Jordan Poole more than a punch did. Right? So whoever leaked the video wasn't thinking about Jordan Poole. This is going to create problems with him for the foreseeable future. NBA players are going to be bringing it up. They're going to be trash talking him, calling him soft. You know what I mean? And he may be put in a position where he feel like he got to defend himself, retaliate or redeem himself on the NBA court because this video was leaked. So the person who leaked the video caused more problems for Jordan Poole than the actual punch that Draymond Green threw, right? And then you see all of these athletes, yo, if Draymond did that to me, I would have did this and the feet. Come on, man. We see him roughhousing people on a basketball court playing dirty all the time, and nobody is doing nothing to him. We, we brought up a couple of instances where a few NBA players stood up for themselves, but I'm quite sure there's a lot of footage of him bullying, throwing elbows, pushing, and nobody's doing nothing to him. And, and you know, I appreciate his game, to be honest, because I do think that he brings a certain edge to the game. You know, I grew up watching 80s, 90s basketball, you know, watching the Detroit Pistons play, the Chicago Bulls, the New York Knicks, and he brings that type of physicality back to the game. But I appreciate that. But he be bullying people in the NBA court, and they don't be doing nothing. They don't be doing nothing. So it's, like, kind of awkward for me to see all these athletes, you know, um, quarterback, you know, say, yo, you know, Sunday, Sunday, what they call it, Sunday quarterbacking, and, and say what they're going to do. Listen, at the end of the day, we don't need to be acting like this, period. Right, we don't need to be acting a fool like this, and 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 putting each other in bad spaces, putting the, putting the sport in bad spaces, you know, with our with our conduct. Let's not focus on the negativity. Let's focus on how we move forward from this. Because if you guys go out there and trash talk Jordan Poole and say, well, that's why Draymond punched you in the face, or you saw, or you you whatever. You're just as bad as Draymond Green. But let me know in the comments, do you think that Draymond Green hit on Jordan Poole was a sneak attack or it wasn't? Check you guys later. Peace.